everyone. So, oh, my eyes. Hey everyone. So, today, oh my god, so exciting. I can finally show you my Christmas calendar. It's massive. I can't bloody believe it. It's so cute. So, this is the ultimate, I think it's the Body Shop's ultimate Christmas calendar. And I really wanted to get this again this year. I got it last year and I just absolutely loved it. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to do like a little unboxing slash review of the products. I don't think I've used them all. I haven't looked yet. Um, but yeah, let's get into it. So, oh god, wow, so this is what it, the full calendar looks like, wow, oh, now I don't know whether to do it, like from 1 to 25, or to kind of mix and match with all of them and see, so, I think I'm gonna do it once 25. So, number one. Oh, oh yay. Um, this is the vitamin E moisture moisture <laughs> moisture cream and it's for all skin types. Um I I'm not gonna open any of these because I want to wait until Christmas but I know that these are really nice they smell really nice as well I haven't used it yet but I'm definitely looking forward to using this it's I think it's a little mini because they do bigger sized uh, tubs so yes that was, that's the first official Christmas number one <laughs> that's the first official door for Christmas 2020 Oh, it makes me nervous trying to open all these because I like to have the surprise. I don't know about anybody else, but I definitely like the surprise more than opening like your calendar before. But I kind of like doing it like this as well. So, number two, <laughs> I couldn't find it. So my assumption is that this is the full product. I could be wrong. Ooh. Yes, that is so good. So yes, this is actually a full product and I really, really like this scent as well. It's the Mango Shower Gel and it just smells really, really nice. I know that the yogurt is really good actually. I liked the yogurt a lot. So yeah, if you like fruity scents this would be really good for you and I've actually noticed I don't know if this is just my mum or like you can give it to any other mums I know that mine definitely likes fruitier scents so definitely a good Christmas present if you buy it separately from the calendar or your or you want to share your calendar with somebody so that would be a really good thing like for you to share with your mum oh this is cute does anyone else ever really get worried about spoiling the packaging? Yeah. Oh, cute. Oh. oh, that's cute. So this is the mango uh, lip butter. I've never used a lip butter. I want to know. If anybody else has used a lip butter, are they any good? Because I haven't used them. But I'm really actually looking forward to using it. I get really crackly lips in winter. So I'm happy about that. Oh, it's so cute. Dun, dun. 
Why are we going for a Jaws right now? Number four. Oh. So, this is number four. I really like the packaging this year. I mean, I love the fact that all of, from what I can tell, all of the people on the box have Christmas jumpers. And I specifically got a little wintry jumper to wear so that I could fit in with the rest of the calendar. Oh, flipping heck, I'm terrible. I don't know where it is. Got it. Oh. Oh no. No, 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 no. Mum, you'll be getting this in your um in your Christmas stocking this year. So, some people don't like the smell. I'm one of those people, but I know that there are other people who love it and it's the pink grapefruit scent. Now, it's not my favorite. I have to say, but my mum absolutely loves it. So if you don't like it, I'm sure somebody else will. And it's the hand cream. Really cute packaging. Really like the um, the colour of it. But the scent is just, it's just not for me. So mum, expect this in your, uh, in your stocking. <laughs> so, how is everybody's day? I feel like... I never ask that. What are you doing today? Are you watching this? Are you going out for the day? Are you with parents or with your partner? Come on, Fran. So, I have a feeling this is going to be another full-sized product. Does anybody love, like product calendars like beauty product calendars or do you love the traditional chocolate or the paper calendar my dad has a thing for the paper calendars which is really cute because you like he likes to see all the really cute um pictures behind the doors so this one is the banana shampoo i've heard good things i do have the banana hair mask and I'm not keen on the smell, but I really like how it leaves my hair. Obviously, I've not used it recently. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I mean, I need a haircut. I haven't had a haircut since April. So, it needs doing. But, yes, definitely would recommend. The smell might not be the best, but the feeling of your hair once you've washed it and it's all dry if you air dry it or if you blow dry it either way it will smell really nice afterwards and it will feel really nice too i couldn't think of the words then so yes definitely definitely a good purchase i would recommend i'll probably say that like a thousand times i'll probably say that another 20 times whilst this video is going on so Number six. Come on, number six. Ah. See, I love the ones at the top because you've got the roof and it makes it easier to get the items out. But when it's the bottom, it's just a pain in the backside. <laughs> so, oh yes, I love these. So, this is just a plain sheet mask. Really, really good for your skin. Really would recommend these because... They leave your skin feeling like a baby's bum. <laughs> um, I have actually used this one and I... A sh I think a sheet mask has to be used at least maybe once a month because they're one of those things that you... Like you can really get a good decent amount of use out of that one sheet mask but it's... Because it's only one it's like you sway towards the um the full size tubs which are also really good but i would definitely recommend these i would have them if i was going to see one of my friends and we had a sleepover um yeah i would definitely take these because they're like they're really nice to put on your face so yeah 
Let's put it away and get the next one out. Oh God, this is where it all comes crumbling down. Come on, there you go. I always get so worried about the packaging. Seven. Number seven. Oh yay. These, oh my God. The facial brushes, they're so good. I love these, I have one, and I use them for my face masks when I do them. Uh, they're really, oh, if, I, if, if it wasn't for the fact that I already had one, and that I've now got another one, I would purchase it on its own because it's so much easier to apply your face mask with a brush. I would put this on your list. If it's something that you're looking at getting, I would definitely get it and um, yeah I would get it <laughs> but if you're a good boyfriend definitely get this for your partner if she likes a good face mask so there you go there you go so put that away there it is. Number eight, and this is heavy. I can feel that this one's gonna be big. I just heard the door slam. Which means Mama is home. Oh my God. This one's my second to favorite face mask from the body shop. And it's a full size one as well, so I'm really happy about it. It's the Himalayan Charcoal Purifying Glow Mask. And it's so good. I actually love it. It's so nice. I'll, um, I'll go and grab my other one so I can show you the texture of that, actually. Stay there. So, I've used this one. Oh god, you can tell. <laughs> so this is what it looks like. Oh, will you pick up? It's like the black hole of no return. But yes, uh, that is what it looks like. You should be able to see it a little bit better in the light, but you can tell I've used a lot. <laughs> um, yeah, it just smells really good. It smells like tea tree. I don't know if there's tea tree in it. I could probably be making myself look foolish right now but yes I just it's a really good definitely a really good face mask it takes everything all the dirtiness off your face and it's just a really lovely smell and yeah I would again it's one of those things that you should definitely consider buying like alone rather than in just the calendar as well so then that way you've got like different varieties and different options of everything so Number nine. God, it's like Scarlet's here and I'm talking to my calendar as if I was speaking Scarlet. Come on. There you go. So, number nine. Let's have a look. Oh, God. <gasps> Yay! What's that? it is so you saw a minute ago that there was a banana shampoo this is the banana conditioner so yes there you go if you like a banana you'll like the calendar i don't know what else to say about that it will, as i said like with the with the shampoo it will make your hair insanely soft so this will probably make it even more soft so It's like a spider. <laughs> Number ten. <gasps> cute. Oh. oh, cute. Oh, I don't wear makeup, but, but. 
see i don't wear makeup but the thing is it's so cute the packaging's really cute definitely gonna give it a go even though i don't wear makeup but it's just really cute this mascara is so cute i think the packaging's really cute i will have to update you whether it's good mascara or not because i don't usually wear makeup so yes I'm definitely giving that a go though next we have no i thought there wasn't anything in it for a second but yes next we have number 11. oh cute so this one this is the i'm gonna say just coffee because i can't pronounce words very well so this is the body shop coffee uh face mask and it's really really good for your skin um if you don't like coffee it's not going to be for you it is really really strong i've actually had a min mini one of these before so that's what it looks like come on so yes that is what it looks like and it's just a really really cute thing to have on the go obviously you can't put a face mask on whilst you're out and about but if you as i said if you go to a friend's house really good to have like and then you can kind of share it if you want but yeah it's definitely a good one and it is it's a little bit gloopy to take off it's very like um silky but it is it is a really lovely face mask i have tried it and i would definitely use it again after this <laughs> so you'll notice that i make a lot of like silly noises but that's beside the point look preview my christmas bedding is already on <laughs> not crazy at all although to be fair the christmas tree is going up in november i'm not gonna lie so <laughs> number 12 oh sorry yes this is what it looks like i think it's a full product i'm not too sure i haven't seen it um when i've been in a body shop like i haven't seen this particular product oh cute i actually have one <laughs> i got one in last year's calendar but it's not the same one so yes i haven't technically seen it in the shop um it's the emergicizing if i've pronounced that wrong as i said i'm awful with words face mist and i don't know what scent it is actually we shall have to find out do you know what i think it's peach but i'm gonna i know i said i wouldn't but i'm going to <sighs> my mum would like that that's very tropical very nice i like that a lot <laughs> for dull tired grumpy skin definitely good for my face so yes i will definitely use that i know that the mists are actually actually really nice to use on your face um kind of makes you for me it kind of makes me feel like it's uplifted my face uh after i've done a proper skincare evening and like that is the last thing i'll put on my face is face mist so yes I would recommend that i haven't used it yet but i would recommend the face mists because they are really nice to have number 13 show your face <laughs> oh my this could take a while so never mind <laughs> so number 13 really cute i love the packaging again a full-sized oh are you gonna stand yes you are so again a full-sized um a full-sized product in this one and it's the pink grapefruit as i said i'm not a big fan but this will be going to good use as i'll give it to my mother so yes again cute packaging not the best scent but i wouldn't say no to it for gifts and things like that so if you don't like it yourself give it to somebody that you love i'm sure they'll like it sorry i just thought my mum came upstairs she did not 
Number fourteen. Oh my gosh, that reminds me of Arthur Christmas. Look at that little package. I need to watch Christmas film today. It's got to be done. I watched some last night and like I couldn't get into it. But it was one of those ones where you have to keep watching and watching to get into it. But I'm definitely going to watch one after this. So. Oh my god, that's cute. That is so cute. Sorry. So, um, this is the Matte Lip Liquid. Again, I did say that I don't wear makeup. But for somebody who does, um, I would definitely recommend this. Especially, well obviously at the moment things are kind of up and down with COVID. But if like when things return back to normal i would definitely wear this kind of thing for new year's eve christmas day boxing day new year's eve that's all that's the kind of vibe i get from this it's definitely new year's eve so yes i really want to see what it looks like but i can't i can't can't do it again <laughs> so there's that And date nights as well. I would definitely wear that on a date night. 15. Where are you, 15? Come on. 15. Santa. Oh my God, Santa. Oh my God. Is this full size? Oh my god, why haven't I seen these? They're so cute. So this is the Berry Bath Blend. And I can't use it yet because I don't have a bath. Um, Hydrating Bath Foam. Oh my god. And it's got strawberry seed oil, beetroot and bilberry extract. The packaging's really like simple but really cute. I love it so much. I love that. Oh my god, I can't wait to get a bath. <sighs> I'm like ready for Christmas so bad. Just put Netflix on at Christmas time, get the blankets out, get the cups of hot chocolate with marshmallows and cream. Get all the all, all the fluffy socks. And, and the pets, if you have pets, cats and dogs. I'm so ready for Christmas. So, oh, that's cute. Number 16. I don't know why I haven't showed you all the packaging. I feel like I should have done that, but I do apologise. You'll have to look on the website for any further packaging. <laughs> So really love, love this. Was so surprised when I saw it um, in the shop. And it's just a really cute headband to either wear like while you're at home or for me, I would wear mine when putting face masks on. It's got a really cute bow tie look in the middle. And I really like it, it's so cute. And you could wear it all year round because it's got stars on it and it hasn't got reindeer, um, reindeer antlers on the top like my other one or a powerpuff girl bow as i have a powerpuff girl one as well so number 17 17 Ooh. god so oh cute snowman mr snowman come on snowman yay oh this one popped out from the bottom what is it? Oh, cute. So this is the gentle facial wash. And I have a feeling this is going to be really nice actually. Simple packaging. Really, really cute. Um, the scent is really nice. I think from what I can remember, it's like a really um, spring scent. Even though we're nearly in winter now. As it's peeing it down with rain outside. And... Everybody's indoors, other than from being indoors because of COVID. <laughs> so, yes, would recommend as like a singular purchase if you need something to 
make yourself feel good after a shower um, or during a shower I would probably put this on during a shower just because it would be easier to take it all off so yeah would definitely recommend Oops. are you going back in there you go we're nearly finished so oh cute oh it looks like Ben in a Christmas tree <laughs> oh sorry Ben <laughs> oh cute that was like whoa um this is another lip butter and I think it's, yeah, it's in a sense strawberry. So I can't wait to use that. That looks really cute. I would say that that's going to be a really nice scent and really, really good for cracked lips. So yes. Number 19 is a little large. It's as big as my head. That's mad. So yeah, that's what it looks like. Oh, it's so cute. Oh. Full product. I think it's safe to say it's huge. Wow. So, this, and I know this one smells super good because I, I, I'm somebody who really likes sweet smells and this is definitely a really sweet scent. It's the almond milk and honey body butter. I can't believe that's in the calendar. I'm in, I'm impressed, very impressed right now. So that's what it looks like. Packaging's really, really cute. And yeah, it's really good for dry skin. And I can't wait to use that. Hello. <laughs> Hello. So yes, I definitely can't wait to use that. Oh my god. Christmas. As me and my friend would say a lot. <laughs> Come on, 20. Get out of the box. I know you don't want to come out, but you have to. God, it's not wanting to come out at all. Hang on a minute, people. Oh, please excuse the mess behind me. It needs um, improvements in the room. <laughs> there you go. Took long enough. So. Oh, that was a struggle, wasn't it? A flipping heck. Right, so. Number 20, that's what it looks like. I'm ready for my Christmas pudding. Although, to be fair, I might say something a bit controversial. I'm not keen on Christmas pudding, but mince pies are the best thing ever. What is it about Christmas pudding? I'm just, I don't know. I'm getting a bit older, so maybe my taste buds will change. I know that with Brussels sprouts, I used to hate them, like proper hate them. Now, I really like them. The logic. Oh, I'll give this to Ali. Maybe. Um, it's the chamomile gentle eye makeup remover. I don't know why I just paused. Apologies. Um, I hear good things about this. Not keen on the smell, which is why I gave it to my friend last year. <laughs> um, but yes i have heard that these are actually quite good and yes would recommend to someone who wears makeup i don't wear makeup i'm sorry so that's what it looks like it's just so simple i really like the packaging and the little daisies on the side it's just really cute and yeah i don't know what else to say on that one Oh, full-size packaging. 
Like the full size products are just insane. Like I'm so impressed with this year's calendar. And for the price, I mean, excuse me. So for the price, it's 130 pounds for the, the ultimate calendar. I think for the medium, it's 70 pounds. And for the small, it's 50 pounds. If I'm wrong, I will pop that on the screen, but um, yeah, for all the products that you get, and that a lot of them are full size, I think that's pretty damn good value for money. Like, I know that it's gone up in price since last year, but no, I'm sorry. I think this year is definitely top last year. So, 21. <gasps> Yay! Oh, cute. Meow. Cat. I really like that. <laughs> Actually, there's a funny story. My, um... So you see what the cat's doing, trying to take the uh, ornament down from the ceiling. <laughs> a few years back, my, uh... My family have, like, Christmas parties. <laughs> and one of the guests that was there started dancing around the room. We were all kind of merry at that point, so... <laughs> It was quite comical watching him like dancing and stuff and we we had really tacky uh christmas decorations sorry dad i do love you still but the christmas decorations for the ceiling just no um and a couple of them were like dangling down quite low <laughs> so he decided to like start slapping the the Christmas on uh, Christmas decoration, and it was just so funny. And then he just ripped the whole thing down. Oh my god, it was so funny. I think I've got it on video as well. It was literally one of the funniest things that happened at Christmas. But that was a good one. That was definitely a good good year for Christmas. So, right, I've gone off on a tangent. Number twenty one. We're nearly finished. So then you can go and. Go get your hot chocolates and your blankets and Christmas films. Or Halloween films, dependent on how you feel about Christmas and Halloween. So, this is the Vitamin C Glow Sheet Mask. Again, as I said, I keep repeating myself, but it is just really good. Like, if you're with friends, you can have face masks together. If you want to do it alone, obviously that's, that's completely fine as well. But, that is just... It, they're really good for your skin. I can't... Like, I can't recommend them anymore because, like, I have so many face masks, like, these ones, the charcoal and British rose ones and stuff like that. But I also really do like these. So, do what you will. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. So, what do people have planned for the weekend? Do tell. I'm intrigued. I'm, what am I doing? So, at the moment, it is Sunday right now for me, so uh, the weekend is kind of gone. I went to go and see my grandpa yesterday, and he was he was okay. Um, it was really lovely to see him again, and my dad is with him today, and he sent me a really, really cute picture, so that was really nice. Um, but yeah, what are you guys doing for the weekend? Are you staying in are you going to visit family or friends if you can like obviously under six people and it it's sad but it's it just needs to be done i think um yeah i don't really know i'm going off on a tangent so i do apologize let's get back to doing the calendar so 22 we're nearly finished if you are doing anything quick thing if you are doing anything this weekend watch a christmas film best thing i'm telling you is the best thing so number 22 oh it's just so cute i love it i love it all i can't i, can't. I just can't <gasps> I haven't tried this yet and I've been really waiting to try it. Oh my God. Right, so you have my normal face mask and then you've got the Himalayan charcoal purifying clay wash 
oh my god i haven't tried it yet and i've been dying to try it oh my god i can't wait to put that on i'm so ready i'm just so ready and i can't i just can't do it now <sighs> it's a sad day but when christmas comes all the products will go out i'm just talking rubbish now aren't i i am so we're nearly there people we're nearly there do you know what yes there is 25 for some reason i thought there was 24 for a second so ooh, it's the third to last one so that's what it looks like and this is number 23 again full-sized one this is what i mean about the products like being the calendar being worth the money because you're saving so much money by just buying the calendar oh my god i can't wait so this is the almond hand and nail manicure cream and the almond products from the body shop are like the best so that's what it looks like i feel like that's very autumnal like it's not Christmassy Christmassy but it's like autumnal and I really like that kind of Thanksgiving vibes Ooh. Thanksgiving I'm gonna miss it this year Ooh. FaceTime Second to last one. Dun, 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 dun. If I can get it out of the box. Oh my god, that's literally going to be me on Christmas Day. Oh my god, that's so funny but so cute. Is that not everybody on Christmas Day? Like at the at the end when you've ha had all the food, all the snacks, and you're just like, right, I'm going to fall asleep in front of Wallace and Gromit and pass out, and that's it. <laughs> literally the best time yes see luckily my mum doesn't like this but this is one of my favorites again a full-size product oh god i nearly opened it it's the british rose body yogurt and if it would focus i can show you so there you go that's what it looks like and it just smells really floral floral like and yeah it's just a really nice thing to put on in the evening you can obviously put it all over so like your it's a body yogurt so you can put it all over it's just a really nice scent and it's really silky actually when you put it on it's very like it's almost watery it's that silky but it's like a, in a good way because then it all kind of melts into your skin which is really nice <sighs> i'm very sad to say that it's that oh my god that's so cute sorry right i'm very sad to say that it's the last very last product and hopefully i'll forget everything that i've like mentioned and then that way it'll all be a surprise for christmas but it's the last one the big one Number 25, Christmas Day. Get your mince pies and your crackers and cheese. Cheese and crackers, crackers and cheese. Oh, and all the chocolate coins. Oh my God, does anybody like the chocolate coins? Oh, so the very last one is this one. Oh my God, how cute. I love the fact that like, it's just an au naturel. I really like that but oh my god how cute so I'm actually a little bit gutted luckily we get to like open it all again like open our calendars throughout December so it's okay Ooh, that was close so we have some gel no. Oh, I did wonder where that was. So, the last thing that is in this calendar is probably the best thing, actually. 
and I'm really happy that it's on Christmas Day is it's the It's the Drops of Youth, Youth Concentrate, and I am going to open the box as well in a minute. So, this is what it looks like. How cute. I have a serious like, problem with packaging. Honestly, if I see a really cute packaging, it takes me so long to throw it out because it's just too cute to like throw away. So, now what I do is... I'll take a picture if it's that good I will take a picture and then when I'm like ready I'll throw it out like the second that I take a picture but when I'm ready I'll then delete the pictures <sighs> is anybody else like that or is that just me being weird so yeah that's what the top looks like and literally this was one of my like staples I mean it still is I just don't use it as often but this is like one of my staples when I do a skincare it's um like it's just so good it melts into your face and it smells really nice i mean yeah i would definitely say that this is my absolute favorite part of like my skincare routine um because it just as i said it melts into your face and i don't know it just oh my god it just give it gives me the feels so bad but yes so this is the drops of youth, as I said, youth concentrate, and oh my god, you have to see it. It's like a serum, essentially. It's like a little, you know, like if you make a Christmas pudding, you've got one of those, like, drops. It's one of those, so you put your alcohol in it, and then put all the alcohol into your cake. It's essentially one of those, but you put it in your face, and it's not alcohol. So, yes, that's what it looks like oh my god it's like please use me <laughs> so yeah i would honestly i know i've said this like a hundred times already but i would honestly buy this separately and i would buy the biggest one i'm not sure if this is the biggest one i'll double check but definitely if you're going to get anything for your face like skincare wise would it would be this hands down because it just oh my god it just makes your skin so smooth so this with a mixture of this as like your individual uh purchases if you don't want to buy the calendar or you've like all oh, the calendars now out of stock kind of thing if you can't get the calendar would definitely use these two items as stocking fillers for someone they are honestly the best so there you go that's the rest of the calendar of 2020. I'm a little bit gutted, but I'm also very happy. And yes, oh God, there's so much, so much to put away. I don't want to put it away. But anyway, that's it now. It's all gone away. Oh, there you go, all back to normal. So, Oh, so heavy. So, oh. if you've enjoyed this video, then just give it a like and share if you want to share it and and all the good stuff. Like, subscribe, and just have a really good weekend. If you're like chilling and you're not doing a lot, flipping enjoy it. And if you're going out, then just just have fun and have a good day like and a good weekend obviously as i said go get your hot drinks and go and watch a christmas movie because that is exactly what i'm doing so yes thank you for watching and i will see you next week if you do have any video suggestions that would be really good um i'm like as you know i'm things are a little bit up in the air so at the moment so um just gonna take it each like each day as it comes really so thank you for watching i will stop rambling on now and i hope you have a lovely weekend bye guys